At issue here are comments that Trump made after the 2020 election when he tried to overturn the results. Now, the judge is expected to make a ruling at a later date. All right, let's bring in our guest. Joining us to discuss, National Trial Attorney Michael Jaffer is with us and retired police commander and host of the Profiling Evil podcast. Mike King joins us as well. Gentlemen, great to see you. Thank you so much for joining me here on the program. Let's begin right there. You heard the arguments. They were laid out very well uh, by the very talented attorneys in uh, that election in interference case. Michael J. Ford, I'm going to start with you. One side says, hey, the president was just engaging in political speech. He was doing what anyone would do, challenging the election and the election results. The other side is saying, well, you know, that speech might be just political speech, but when it's in the furtherance of a RICO case, whether it's in furtherance of a crime, then it's certainly not protected. Well, yeah, absolutely. They had to argue in front of and Judge McAfee. I, I feel bad for him because he had to do his homework and brush up on on his constitutional law, and he had to just you know uh, discern the difference between a facial challenge and as a pie challenge, right? So this is not exactly the the easiest type of case to follow for a viewer. But basically, what they're saying is it's exactly what you laid out, which hey. He is allowed to have political speech. The, the Trump side is saying he's allowed to have political speech. Anything, everything goes. And the other side is saying, well, not everything goes. If you're furthering a crime, if your intent was to break the law, it doesn't matter what your what your uh, political speech was. You could say political speech, hey, I want to murder somebody. That doesn't mean that that's allowed because you're doing it on a on a on a stump on a campaign stump speech, right? So it's going to be interesting to see how Judge McAfee rules. My my interpretation is I think he's going to let the he's going to have to let the case go along and let the facts bear out because what the Trump side is saying is more for me a closing argument type type statement not as the case is is moot on day one.